Hi there, if you've already found my YouTube Partner Program Eligibility Dashboard and want to know how to swap in your own data, skip to this timecode. But if you want to know what it does and why I made it, keep watching the first part. Okay, so most of you are probably aware that YouTube has new criteria to get into the YouTube Partner Program. And two of those are two key metrics which are getting 1,000 lifetime subscriptions to your channel, but also getting 4,000 watch hours in the previous 12 months on a rolling basis. So whether you agree with these changes or not, you all probably want to see how you're tracking to meet these numbers or maintain them. Which is why I've built this simple, free dashboard using Google Data Studio that anyone can use with their own YouTube channel data in seconds. I did this as I found the metrics in the actual YouTube analytics page aren't perfect. They deal in minutes, kind of talk about hours, but then if you get too far, it rolls back up into days. So if you just want to find out how you're doing for that 4,000 hours watch time, it's not the best. So I've made sure the report I've made does all the heavy lifting for you. It converts all the watch time to hours and that's it. Talks about how you are tracking percentage wise to those goals and also has some simple line charts so you can see how you're trending to meet those targets as well. And as this report is a web page, it's viewable both on your desktop and mobile phone. You just bookmark the page and you have these figures at your fingertips no matter where you are. There's also a second page where you can quickly see which videos in your channel are driving the most toward that watch time goal. Okay, so to swap in your own YouTube channel data, it takes less than a minute. First off, just make sure you're doing this on a desktop for that one-off process and also that you're already logged into your YouTube channel in the same browser. So all you do is click up here on this data control and you'll see a drop down. Just be aware, the default data for this dashboard is using my own YouTube account's data. So if the figures aren't actually matching up to your account, you're probably seeing mine before you've switched to yours. Now the cool thing about data controls in Google Data Studio is you will only see the data sources you have access to. So each person will see something different. So with that in mind, just select your YouTube account from the dropdown and two things will happen. First off, your channel's data should appear. And this is my like personal YouTube account, so it's very small. But also the URL at the top will now suddenly change to your unique code for your data and your report. So now if you save this or bookmark it in your browser and you just open it up on your mobile or your desktop, you'll now see this report so you have access to the key metrics you need to get into the YouTube Partner Program at your fingertips wherever you are. I hope this goes some way to helping you and your channel succeed. Feel free to share this with other up and coming YouTubers as well. And if this helps you out, leave a like and a comment on this video and subscribe to the channel for more cool things like this. Thank you very much.